Pressure canners are a great tool for preserving low acid foods, and I hope this brief overview will help you feel comfortable putting yours to use. A good pressure canner can give you many years of service, and even old canners like these have a lot of life left in them. So to begin with, let's look at the different types of pressure canners. Weighted gauges are simple, robust, and don't need to be tested for accuracy. Dial gauges are precise, but need to be tested annually to make sure they're calibrated properly. All canners will have a vent pipe that allows air to vent from the canner before you bring it up to pressure. Make sure this remains free from food or debris so air and steam can escape. Most canners will have rubber gaskets that help ensure an airtight seal. Dried out or cracked gaskets need to be replaced and can usually be found at your local hardware store or online. Canners should come with a rack that allows water to circulate underneath the jars while they're in the canner. This helps to prevent jar breakage. All canners should have some sort of pressure relief mechanism. In modern canners, this is typically a rubber plug that will blow off if too much pressure builds inside the canner. Make sure that this rubber piece remains soft and pliable so that it will work correctly. Your local extension office is a great place to get your canner checked and tested. While you're there, you can pick up our Canners Corner bulletins to help get you started. So have fun trying pressure canning with this season's harvest.